hi loves welcome back to my channel in this video i will show you how i cooked this nigerian fried rice so delicious trust me you will love this one in case today is your first time here you're welcome i am emmanuela welcome to ellis tv and please don't forget to subscribe let's get started I started by seasoning the chicken. The protein I'm using is chicken. You can use any protein of choice. So I added some onion, some seasoning cube and salt. And then I added curry and chicken powder. Then I allowed that to cook for 10 to 15 minutes. After that, I came back and added some water. Of course, you are going to use the water for cooking. After cooking the chicken, I went ahead and fried it. You can as well grill your chicken or you eat it like that. So do you what you want. At this point, I went ahead and flipped the chicken over to the other side. If you are watching this video at this point and you like it, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up, big thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not and turn on your bell notification so that you will be among first to be notified anytime I upload a new video. It's totally free. As you do so, may God bless you. So after a while, I bring it out from oil. I don't want it to fry very well because what I'm using is hard chicken. After that, to an empty pan, I added in cooking oil. Adding my meat spices, natural meat spices I made myself. Then I go in with washed rice. I'm using long grain Nigerian rice. You can use any rice of choice. I go ahead and toast it. I'll toast for a while until the color changed. Why I'm doing this is because I'm not going to cook it. If you don't want this pattern you can parboil your rice or you can wash with hot water to remove the starch but trust me this one is also good if you have not given it a try try it and you like it as you can see now the color has changed and is well fried then i'll go ahead and start cooking it so i go ahead and add it to the pot i'll be cooking it with this pot contains the chicken stock and i'll go ahead and add some water to the level of my cooking I added in bay leaf, some chicken seasoning cube, some chicken powder, some salt, and this is pepper, fresh pepper. I added it in, give it a well mix, allow that to cook. As the rice was cooking, I started preparing the vegetables I will be using for the rice. Here is sausage I will be using. You can use beef, liver, shrimps, or anything you prefer. Here is carrots and here I have also green beans. At this point I checked and the rice was well cooked then I go ahead and start cooking. In my pan I added some margarine. I allowed that to melt. After that I go in with the sausage. I will be cooking this for 2 minutes. I go in with the carrots and green beans. I stir fried for 2 minutes. This is red kidney beans, then sweet corn. I will then season it so that it will have its own taste. I seasoned with chicken seasoning cube, some salt. I didn't add much seasoning because the rice already was seasoned. I then stir fry for some minutes. At this point, I added the cooked rice. Then I'll go ahead and mix it too well to combine. As you can see, the rice is giving. This rice is giving everything. Everything fried rice can give. You can see the color, the multiple colors, everything. Very simple and delicious. It's not a must that you use basmati before your fried rice will be fine and delicious. As you can see this one. 
if you are watching at this point you are my g please subscribe if you have not and turn on your bell notification to be notified anytime i upload a new video and to my returning subscribers you always come back to watch my videos you like you share may god bless you i really appreciate thank you so much see you guys in my next one but for now bye